so we're only six and three quarter hours early for our ferry. <laughs> we like to be here early, you know. <laughs> it's, like, it's like super quiet. <laughs> A beautiful day for it. Oh my god. Sunny afternoon. We made like really good time. We left at 10 o'clock this morning and, and it's that doesn't help. 8 o'clock at night now, but we stopped off a couple of times on the way down, didn't we? We stopped yeah. to get food and then we went to our wedding venue. Uh, Chitara Court. Yeah. And uh, tired. I've got like the washed out ginger thing going on. <laughs> you, look, you look like you're coming home. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so the ferry's going to take like, what, four and a half hours, four hours, something like that. And then we're going straight to Waterford. Yay! We are well packed because we're camping the entire week. Uh, that's Marcus the sloth in the background. Could not miss out on his first holiday. No, he, he comes everywhere. <laughs> I love him. Um, yeah, so we will check in when we're on the ferry, which Carl is super excited about. Because what's your favourite thing? Oh, dude, I love boats. I love a boat. I love, a, I love, I love boats, me. Yeah. Like, if if I had a preference to travel, it would be ocean. I don't care how long it takes. Just give me a good boat. Because um, why do we have to get the ferry instead of getting the plane? I hear people crying out, but the plane is so much cheaper than the ferry. Yeah. Well, guess what. It is cheaper to drive around an island with your own goddamn car than it is to spend 200 euros a day okay. hiring a car. <laughs> What's the real reason why we're getting the ferry? Because it's cheaper. And? I don't like flying. I don't trust planes. Don't trust them. What do you do when we try and put you on a plane? I freak out. Sit on the tarmac. Tell yeah. the, demand the plane leaves without you while you're sat on the tarmac. <laughs> you, can, you can leave without me. It's fine. Totally fine. Oh. I'm... I've got money. Like I can, I can order a, a Uber. I can order a Uber, an Uber, or I can, I can get a taxi. It's fine. I can walk. I've got feet. I've got legs. You're a nightmare. I've got legs. <laughs> we will check in in a bit. So it's 11 p.m. We have been here since five. No, we haven't. We've been here since <laughs> we've been here three hours. It feels a lot longer. It is. We're both really, really we've tired. Been here, we've been here for about three days now. <laughs> 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 Waiting for this ferry to turn up. It's never going to oh. turn up. Neither of us have had any... Well, actually, that's not true. You had a little bit of sleep in the car on the way here. Yeah, I passed up for like half a second. Yeah, I haven't had not any long. sleep. I have like a migraine brewing as well. And I think part of it is like the lights in the car park because they're shining like directly in our car. They're yeah, like that horrible yellow, orangey, like luminescent, horrible colour. But we... Uh, <laughs> it's not fun. I've done the whole anxiety of, oh my God, do I need like the green insurance card thing to drive and... Like, why is there two little kiosk things? And which lane am I supposed to be in? And I, there's like, what, one, two, three, four cars? <laughs> it's going to be a very, very And a van. Crossing. It's going to be, hopefully be a really quiet crossing. But it's not windy. It's really, really calm. The last time we did this, I got violently sick everywhere. She gets violently sick every time we cross. Really bad motion sickness. So I'm hoping it's going to be like a really calm crossing. But I have just, a blanket. So worst case scenario, we'll just snuggle down outside. <laughs> We have coats. That helps. It'll be fine. It can't be any colder than the top of a mountain. It'll be fine. But um, when we eventually board, yeah, when in we in like two weeks' time, <laughs> if we if we ever board, and then I had all the anxieties of like, do you leave your car in gear on the ferry or just your handbrake? Because like everyone's opinion is different, and we've only had this car like you leave your car in gear with the handbrake on. We've had this car like two months, and I do trust the handbrake. But at the same time, I'm like, please, God, don't let any more cars turn up. I need it to be this quiet because then there's literally nobody for it to roll into. <laughs> we trust our car. We don't trust anyone else's car. So, <laughs> someone can roll into the back of me. I won't be angry. I just don't want to be the person to roll into the back of someone else. Well, you won't be angry because this is like your present car. I pay for the damn thing. I will be angry. <laughs> I drive you everywhere. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Oh, you're right. painting yourself in a good light. <laughs> Who's tired? Who's overtired? Who is so overtired? Oh, we will we will uh be back in a bit, hopefully on, on the boat. So we shall see. Oh. So it's midnight. This uh, is really flattering. It's uh day five <laughs> of the waiting to board. This is like Blair Witch level video recording. Oh. Uh it's now midnight and we're just riding the sugar high now. Um We have eaten the last seagull in port. We're watching the American. They're actually very crunchy. 
watching the American office. Very crunchy bars. Um, they did open the departures lounge so we could go to the toilet, which is amazing. They, <laughs> opened, they opened that two days ago. I'm amazed that, Still no like, stuff. from an endometriosis point of view, it's been a pretty easy day. So I don't want to jinx it, and I probably have. We're very excited to get to Ireland and do a full day and then check in as quick as humanly possible to set up camp. This two-week two holiday, to... the first three days have been sitting here waiting in <laughs> line. <laughs> Hopefully, hopefully the next time we really will be on the ferry when we come back. But we can, but hope. Stay tuned. <laughs> so it's been five and a half hours. Seven hours and fifty days. Seven hours. It's been five hours okay. that we've uh, been waiting to board. Oh, and about nine, ten, eleven, twelve, one, two, seven. Well, yeah. Finally, finally, we're moving. We're not moving. We're not moving. Everyone else Everyone is bloody moving. moving. <laughs> We're not moving. We will never move. This is this is hell. If you if you guys ever want to know what purgatory is like, this is, this is it. <laughs> Jesus Christ. No, it's happening. It's happening. Yeah. Apparently. We're going on to our is still a. Down. We're, we're going. Oh, we just got the thumbs up. Oh, oh. You guys want to? You guys want to watch this? We'll put it down for a second. So just let's get around. This is so exciting, we're moving, we're moving. Alright, I'll see you guys both, this is fun. So we're in, we're going into the low, the low dock. And Korea's really, really psyched that we're moving. I'm really psyched that we're moving. You can see the water, kind of, but not really, because it's dark, because it's two o'clock in the morning. It oh is my god, this looks time. scary. What the fuck? <laughs> this is this looks fun. No, I'm nervous now. Okay, I think you should put the camera down. Okay, serious time. Ten days <laughs> in the waiting line. We finally made it. We did make it. I am so tired. <laughs> I know. We we did have some sleep on the ferry. You know when you like, you know when you have like a really good dessert, or like a, rather a really good start, mm. and then you realise that the head chef, or then you're, then you're told that the head chef of the restaurant has just walked out, mm -hmm. so it's going to be like an hour away. That's what that sleep was like. It's like. Something really, really good, but you have to wait a really long time for the rest of it. <laughs> <laughs> well, our favourite thing to do when we get off the ferry is come to Curraclo because it's not that far from Ross Lair and my brother and his partner used to live in Wexford and we oh. came here with them and I've been, I have brought car here before. This is the hill, this is the place of the hill, isn't it? This is the place that they filmed scenes for Saving Private Ryan. Yes, this is the hill. Where you fell down. Well, I rolled down. Yeah, and you yeah. lost our passports and... I lost everything. Yeah. <laughs> our money and phones and the car keys. Yeah, it's that hill. <laughs> I'm not doing that again. That's the sand dunes, <laughs> but... Yeah. We made it! <laughs> We're alive. It's very beachy. 